You do do systems that uh, contribute to, to space heating as well, um, but generally only, only in new build properties where the whole system is actually designed into the building. Mm -hmm. Now, um, on the continent now, um, at least 30% of all solar thermal systems installed are designed to dual hot water and heating systems, but mm -hmm. we're slightly behind that. And there's a few reasons. First of all, the solar panels are at their weakest point during the winter months mm -hmm. when you want your heating on. Mm -hmm. um, secondly, the, the amount of collector area you need to make a useful contribution is very large. So a very rough rule of thumb is you need one square metre of collector area for every 10 square metres of, of floor spot area to be heated. So you're all of a sudden looking at a very large collector area. Then to deal with that collector area, you also need a very large buffer tank. So in, in most domestic situations, we're looking at two to 300 litres for hot water. Mm -hmm. If you're looking at generating towards the heating as well, you can be looking anywhere up to sort of 5,000 litres. So you, you, you're talking you need a plant room, um, which is fantastic if it's a new build, which has got very high insulation levels, then yes, it can make a very useful contribution to the heating. In, um, again, on the continent, they are now getting houses which are fed 100% from solar, doing all their hot water and heating. Um, but that's quite a big challenge, and I don't think it's something that, that we're quite ready for here yet. Yeah. Um, but certainly, you know, getting about 30% of, of the heating on a new build house where it's all been fully designed into it, it is possible. But retrofitting um, solar thermal for, for heating is um, it's, it's often costs more than it's worth. So in, in most cases, I wouldn't advise it. There's other technologies which are designed to do heating, which will do it a lot better, especially if, if the heat requirement is, is a high level heat that's needed.